Hello there, welcome into Sage Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you so much for being here. Much love and appreciation for you coming through on my channel, and I love it. Thank you so much. If you're new, welcome in. Hit the subscribe button to be a part of our family here. If you are returning, much love and gratitude to you. We're going to get some messages out for you, Cancerian. We're gonna find out what your person wants to say to you. So I'm gonna get some inspired messages from the tarot cards and then we're going to interpret them. Remember that these are general tarot card messages, so all of the messages may not apply to all of you, so take what applies and the rest let it fly. All right, now let's get started. Remember, Cancerian, that you too are a part of this reading here with me. All right, so come through, be present here, breathe. And we're gonna take a deep breath as I welcome you in so I can get the most accurate messages here for you for what your person has to say to you that some of you are obviously refusing to listen to but what do they want to say some of you this person cannot communicate with you they're not it's like the communication is blocked they may think they're communicating with you some of you they may be sending you messages and it's not being received because maybe this person is not aware that they're blocked or, or something with the four of cups energy. You could just be full, like you're like refusing to hear from this person. Some of you, this could be like you're just taking a time off and you're focusing on yourself. And that's the energy. Um, if there's anything else, anything that I miss for some of you that are, are, are actually in your relationship and it's going great. It could be that. You're just, there's something that you're unsure of and you're, you just want to get some confirmation even from your own heart space. All right, so we're going to breathe and welcome in the energy of your person's thoughts, feelings or intentions or whatever word they might want to say toward you. Let's get them out. And these may be some of the messages that they actually sent to you that you haven't read as yet. So we're going to breathe in deeply and then we'll get started by shuffling the cards and allowing the messages to come out for you angels praise and guides welcome in thank you so much for being here and let's get some messages for my lovely beautiful cancerian as they await thank you okay all right now we shuffle messages from cancerous person what does cancerous person want to see And some of you are holding on too tightly in what you expect someone to say to you. <laughs> some of you could be expecting some payment, some rewards, some refunds, some money, back payment, being paid back to you, given back to you, regranted to you, something about money here. Ooh. Some of you feel like what does your person want to say to you? Maybe some, some of them want to come back with the Eight of Cups energy. This person may want to travel back to you. I feel with this Eight of Cups energy, it feels sad and lonesome and broken. And like, it just feels so emotionally sad, like emotionally depleted. This person is holding on to a stick like they can barely hold themselves up. It's like, it's that energy. Like emotionally, this person is just, Wanting to make their way back to you. Look at the moon. The moon may be crying. There may be some sadness here. This person may have really felt they lost you. They want to just... If they could just follow their hearts, they would allow their feet to just take them to you. That's the energy. They could just drift back to you. Some people, was they were standing up against some opposition or they had to fight for you or defend you or they were defending themselves. Or it's just that they they had things to deal with. Some people, some of you, some of you, your person feels sad that you left them alone to maybe to go be with someone else. So that's a kind of sadness. I feel Cancer Pisces Scorpio here. So some of you could have been dating another water sign. And then we have fire sign, and this may be another person for some of you who may be fighting with their feelings to stand up against doubt or disbeliefs to really come through and tell you how they feel like they're afraid to speak up 
they may want the courage to push through all the doubt and the fear and to just tell you how they feel and they may be doing this for some of you you could have heard already from this person it's like this person is aware that you're maybe single and working on yourself and you're looking good you're powering up there's something about the glove on this this woman's hand here i've never noticed it before oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god it's like um being in a vibration where things just come to you manifestation things are not afraid to come into your energy your well your presence is welcoming it feels like you're so relaxed or so in a state of in a vibration where you're in tune with your natural state of well-being and so things are literally just coming into you this person wants to make their way into you they may be afraid because of how beautiful you look how you're shining how you look like things are working out for you how vibrant and alluring not really alluring but this person sees like a shine emanate from you this is my goku energy with the nine of pentacles card cancerian powering up inside out so this person and i hear the word grace this person thinks you're so beautiful like your heart alone is magnificent and it's like they may be, they, they're not sure if they can match up to you or that's the doubt that they're facing. If they'll be able to take care of you or stand by you or stand with you. And so it's like they want to push through to come through to you. All right. So they are maybe already are making their way through to you, Cancerian. Some of them feel like you're everything, like you're their wish, you're their wish come fulfillment when it comes to a person that they value and like highly appreciate and love and see so much potential in right this could be new love and attraction coming in look someone wants to come make you some offer of love maybe someone wants to clear something up for some of you this could be a person from the past wanting to return clear something up with you we have pisces cancer um scorpio energy here heavy cancer pisces want to return to you with, with the Page of Cups energy, maybe sending you a message. That's what I'm saying in the first place. They may be sending you some spiritual quotes or some inspirational message because you shared a relationship like that where they can just send you inspirational quotes or videos. But it's a way for them to communicate with you and sort of say, I'm here and this is how I feel or something like that. So it could be a message. Some of them could be literally coming to you. I feel this person is close to you, closer than... Like this person may get may come close to you. I feel like maybe in a restaurant or something, they may stand they may be standing close to you, wanting to offer something to you. Maybe wanting to speak some truth, give you some knowledge, tell you some background information, make you aware that of what was going on. There was something going on, something being stolen, taken from you, or this person was feeling is feeling like they know that they weren't contributing or giving enough to you. They know they were short giving you the short and like they know they were short changing you for example you know they weren't giving their all to you and this person may want to say i'm sorry this person could be virgo taurus um capricorn energy strong virgo energy with the hermit card cancer want to come in and say i'm sorry clear up some miscommunication perhaps <laughs> <laughs> You are like, I see this ish coming. I don't care. Oh my God. You literally just said that, Cancer. You're like, oh, child. As if you're saying they can keep that. I see it coming. Maybe you already know what the truth is. Any other messages? Any of you want to do something fun? Like, um, try sending me a message. No, a thought, an inspiration okay someone wants to have fun so let's see someone is like okay cool all right mm, blind blind i hear blind like blind as a bat or, or someone is telling me that i'm blind or i'm missing something or i'm not picking up on something we have the eight of swords energy so this is a message that literally just came out and this could have to do with you you telling me something about your person or you're telling me something about me or you let's see blind oh 
I do feel like with the with the hangman and the 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 eight of the eight of swords, it feels like blind. It's like you oh, you're, you have your head in the dark. You know, blind, because it does feel like someone that is sticking their head in the sand, perhaps sticking your head in the sand. Because what does that mean when you stick your head in the sand? What does that mean? You're pretending as if you don't see something that's going on. And that could be the, the moon energy, pretending as if you don't see. Oh, pretending as if you don't see something. And it could be you that's pretending as if you don't see something. Or you don't, you're like, I, I don't care if it happened. I'll just act as if it don't happen. I'll keep my head in the sand about it. But you are already aware. And do you feel powerful because of this? So your intuition already tell, tells you what's going on. Whatever the secret is that this person may want to come back and confess to you, Cancer. Okay, any other messages for Cancer? <laughs> the Page of Pentacles. All right, I'm going to keep this one. Any other messages? All right, so we're going to leave these messages here. Your person may want to reunite with you because they do feel... And then, look, the four, the four cups is back on the bottom of, of the deck. You're not hearing this. You are releasing. You, you probably have already let this person go. They may have decided to walk out of your life and you let them. All right, you let them go. You're like, okay, I'm not stopping you. I don't care if you want to play fool or play the victim or act like you don't know what's going on here between us. Then it's okay. I release you. You can go. I feel like the minute you release this person, you didn't even realize how freeing it would have been for you. And it was so powerful in the way you released them. Okay, I know they want to come back and I hear the word charm. Maybe you look charming. Maybe they want to come back and charm you. But you refuse. You're looking elsewhere. I feel you may have your eyes on someone else at this point. Possibly a new love. Hoping for new... Ooh, child. Possibly a new love. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy you may want to entangle with. <laughs> lockdown. Maybe the Eight of Swords was saying lockdown. Someone wants to lock down with you. There's something else I wanted to do. Um... Hmm. Any messages from the cards for Cancer's person? What does Cancer's person want to see? Five of hearts saying, wee, wee, wee. I'm so sad. Oh, 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 oh. the king of cups. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, okay. So. Okay, so this is your past person. I'm telling you, this is your past person, the five of cups. And then this king flipped out and it feels like this person is here. And they're telling your past person, like, I'm here now. You need to go. I don't know what's going on. But it feels like that energy where your past person is like, this is what I have to say. But then your, your, your current person stands up. Oh my God, this person is amazing. They're so strong and powerful. I do feel like a muscular person for some of you. We're dealing with a male, he's muscular, he's handsome, he's so attractive, and he's everything. I mean, you know, it's just that kind of um, physical attraction, it's everything. And he's so beautiful and powerful and has um, such a beautiful heart. It's just so amazing the way this person knows how to stand up for you too. The way how they literally flipped out. To say, nah, man, um, I'm here now. It's 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 okay. I'm, I got her. She's good. <laughs> Maybe that's why you're not responding to this person. Because you have eyes on someone else. And for some of you, if you have not met yet, their energy is so present. Their energy alone. It's just that the attraction. You are calling in this person so much that you refuse to go back to any past connection. So no matter what this person says, you are standing so powerful in your everything, your most beautiful energy, that you will be attracting great love to you. So it is even your higher self that is saying, no way, Jose. I don't want to hear what you have to say. Okay? That's the power there. Um, and for those of you who are male, of course, this is, a, I feel, a vibrant female. She's outspoken. She knows how to stand up for you and with you and for herself. 
and she's going to tell this past person whoever this is that wants to come around you and she's going to say uh-uh not this one your time is over you know it's that kind of energy it's beautiful it's not possessive it's just it's more like this and it's like this person knows it like their past isn't worth it they they no longer belong here and as i'm saying this could be a higher perspective of yourself and that's what i have for you cancer i hope the messages resonates with you some of you definitely moved on from a past connection and this person wants to come back around and say something but what they're coming with is kind of medial it's not everything it's a page of cups they're not coming out fully and that's what you want they're not coming with everything in their best self as the king of cups you know all right so i'll leave that there for you much love and appreciation i'll see you in the next video remember that you can be to have everything and anything in this world that you desire because you're up and all is within you thank you so much for being here and um, remember to compliment the video of course let youtube know that you enjoy videos like mine you can compliment my video by leaving a thumbs up on it as you go subscribe to my channel and share the videos with those you love all of your support is greatly appreciated do check out the description box below my video for any other information you may require and i'll see you next time much love until then much love bye take care